A late summer primary day in New York, and the hot marquee matchup is a battle of the east versus west sides of Manhattan. We're very fortunate. We've got some really great people on the, on the slate. Two Democratic allies, now political adversaries vying for one seat in the 12th district, and a fresh face shaking up the tight congressional race, forcing Representatives Gerald Nadler and Carolyn Maloney on an 11th hour personal attack. I know both of these folks. I worked with both of them. Okay. Um, so personally, it was a difficult choice. Suraj Patel has entered the fray for a third bid in an effort to unseat the veterans of Capitol Hill. I like what he has to say. It's not like I don't like, I've, I've always voted for Cherry Nadler, but I think now, now is time. Both Nadler and Maloney have served side by side since 1992, but a newly drawn congressional map has them facing off for the first time in this August primary. Towards the end of the summer, so we're hoping that people show out. Meanwhile, the other big contest is in the new look 10th district in Lower Manhattan and Western Brooklyn. The packed race features Dan Goldman, Yuli New, Mondaire Jones, Carlina Rivera, Liz Holtzman, and Joanne Simon. Goldman, the Levi Strauss heir and attorney in President Trump's first impeachment trial, is polling as the one to beat. Most importantly right now is just preserving our democracy. I think our democracy is really hanging on by a thread. Well, remember today, only anyone who is registered as a Democrat here in the city is eligible to vote in this primary day. Uh, the general election matchup will then be, of course, in November. However, uh, we are looking at the early polling numbers, uh, the voter uh, returns so far. Only about 76,000 people voted in the prior nine days of early voting. Uh, there are lots of absentee ballots, though, in this race. Uh, the Board of Elections saying they have over 200,000 of them out. Remains to be seen how many will be returned.